Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I'm going to go and be showing you how to fix the problem that you might be having with Apple Wallet if it says that a card is not added and that you need to contact your card issuer. This is a very simple thing to do, so make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end and follow my steps correctly so you can make sure this works the same for you and you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So the first thing we want to do is to go ahead and open up the official Apple wallet application if you have not already so if you do not already have it opened up what you can do is find it right here on the home page of your iphone next to your app store and settings you can find the wallet icon if you cannot find it this way what you can do is use the search bar at the top of the screen and search for wallet and now find it this way so after finding it you can go ahead and open it up by tapping on it and after opening it up this is going to be the home page you're greeted by where we can go and take a look at all the cards we have added and using the plus button in the upper right corner we can get started adding new cards so you can go ahead and add a debit or credit card that you want to use by clicking on it right here and it's going to enable you to follow the steps and procedure to add it. So what do you do if it says that the card is not added and that you need to contact your card issuer? Basically guys, you want to go ahead and make sure that there isn't an issue with the card itself, your device or your Apple ID setup. So to resolve it guys, you want to start by ensuring your card is eligible for Apple Pay and you want to verify your card details and check for any potential blocks with your bank. You want to make sure that the card from your bank is usable with Apple Pay and guys, if the problem still persists, you want to try updating your device's software, restarting your device or contacting Apple support. If you cannot get, get it to work anyhow you try and you keep adding cards that do not work, you can go and contact Apple support, explain what the problem is and they're going to walk you through step by step on how to fix it. So I hope this video was helpful. If it was, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel. So guys, thanks for watching, take care and bye.